This is the SpinShot Plus control panel. When the machine is switched on, it automatically defaults to the center line. This lets the user align it with the center line of the court, ensuring the balls will be delivered evenly in either two line or horizontal oscillation mode. Here is the display panel showing the oscillation settings. At the moment it is in manual mode. You can start the machine by pressing the enter key here. Here you can see these settings. The first line is the oscillation mode. It is set to manual mode by default. The first thing the user has to do is to set the oscillation mode. Here you can see the random two line vertical and manual modes. If you want to set the machine to random you press the random button here, two line here. Now you can also set it to two line vertical. To do this you have to press the two line button first and then the vertical button here. If you want to go back to the random mode you press the random here. If you want random two line vertical you press the random and then the vertical button here. To go back to the vertical mode, you then press the vertical button again here. And likewise, if you want to change back to the manual mode, then you press the manual button here. Once the oscillation mode has been set, we can then go to these settings here where you can alter the speed, the feed rate, the width, the backspin or topspin, the height uh, controlled by H1 and H2, the width by W1 and W2. And you will see the buttons at the top. We've got the up and down to increase or decrease the values. Here you have to press the function first and then you have the plus and minus signs to increase or decrease the values. You can see there's the speed, the feed. You've also got the W1 and W2 keys here and the H1 and H2 keys. The W1 and W2 keys are just the forehand and backhand widths in os two line oscillation mode. The H1 and H2 keys control the low height and the high height in the vertical oscillation modes. To adjust the spin level you press the spin button and a negative value will give you backspin and a positive value will give you topspin. The height button here, if the machine is not in the vertical oscillation mode, the height value enables you to adjust the heights of the standard balls coming across the net. If the machine is in the vertical oscillation mode, this height button then is controlled by the H1 and H2 keys for the low and high height. Without the vertical oscillation, you just press the height button and then the plus or the minus settings to reduce or increase the normal height. After the height has been changed, you have to press 
the enter key here which then the machine takes effect these plus and minus keys you can either hold the key where it will keep increasing or you can press it individually to use move it one unit at a time once you've made all the alterations, you have to play the play stop button to start the play. You can press it again to stop the machine running. 